I just got the most mysterious email from Abigail Finehaven herself. I opened my phone to an email titled important and then I started freaking out a little bit. I was like, did I do something wrong? Am I bad, bad? Am I bad? <laughs> it goes a little something like this. Hi Cass, I finally got around to seeing your first video on Pinecraft. I loved it, but... <laughs> Q freaking out. You must do me a favor. You must start recording as soon as you log onto the server next time. There is something important I want your reaction to. Also, you must not open this Google Drive link until you find a sign that says you can open it. Q mysterious music. All right, I guess it's time, you guys. Well, let's go ahead and click the play button. I'm really scared. <laughs> okay, I literally don't even know where I logged off, I'm gonna be honest. Last night, it was 2 a.m. I was busy taking a thumbnail. Hello? <laughs> okay, I guess I should head back home. It's nighttime. Is that gonna ruin it, Abby? <laughs> Hi, Moira. Okay, now is not the time for cuddles. <laughs> Apparently, this is serious, man. The email was titled important. Okay, so I take it that I'm looking for a sign because I have to find a sign to open a Google Drive link. I'm gonna take it that it's in my house or something. So we're gonna come over here. There's my green screen, but it's yellow because finding cactus in this server is apparently very difficult. Oh my gosh. <gasps> Is that cat? Oh my gosh. <laughs> Is it a cat right now? Oh my gosh, what? Cass, we found your cat from the village. It's the same one. We had to jump hoops to get it here. We hope you're happy to get your beloved Moira cat back. You can now open the Google Drive and behold our adventure. <gasps> oh my gosh. That's so- oh my gosh. I was scared. I was scared, but- it, <laughs> This is a cat. Oh my gosh. Oh, that's not- ah! <laughs> Oh my gosh, that is so sweet. Oh my gosh. Oh man, oh man, oh man. <gasps> it is my cat. It is my cat. Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> I'm just so happy. Oh my gosh. I like, I'm scared to like do anything right now. Oh my gosh. Well, this. Th oh my gosh. I literally have the biggest smile on my face right now. <laughs> to the adventures of Abby and Flickers rescuing Cass's cat. Now, the first thing we did was I watched Cass's video for the first time eight days after it was posted. <laughs> so that was great. <laughs> Next thing we did is we tried to find the village that Cass's cat was left in. So to do this, we took screenshots Aww. from Cass's video and in the DIN map, which you can access with slash map, we were darting around the place looking for villages that matched the way that Cass's village looked. Oh my and we gosh. knew that it was pretty flat. There wasn't much difference in height. Uh, there wasn't a lot of trees and we couldn't see any water either. Now this did take about half an hour of us <laughs> darting around checking different places, but eventually we found it. She, she yes. would be like here. I can't see you. Oh. <laughs> she would be like in my screenshot. She would wait. Oh my god. No. Wait. Like here. Ooh. In the screenshot. Yeah, no, I think you're right. Yeah. It is! Look at these blocks! Look at these yeah, blocks! Yeah, 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 it looks exactly the same way. Oh, I heard cat! I heard cat! I heard cat! I did. I it's heard here! Cat. We oh found my god. it! <laughs> Yes! Oh my yes! I'm so happy we found the cat. Okay, okay, okay. Um, uh, uh, um, uh, 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 you stay here. I'll, I'll go to Cass's plot and then I'll TP it. Oh wait, no. Yeah. <laughs> wait, no. Wait, no. It's not my cat. Wait, wait. Um. Once we found the cat, our next hurdle was to get it from the village to Cass's house, which unfortunately was about twelve thousand blocks away. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so we're here. Okay. So we're we're here. Okay. And Cass. <laughs> Cass lives. <laughs> I know Cass lives near Bro, you, right? Oh my god, yeah. Cass, Cass lives over here. <laughs> so yeah, that was probably the second oh god, thing we crying. had to figure out. Can I leave this? No, no. Oh my god. 
Oh, it doesn't move because it's sat down. Yes! <laughs> no. No, no, no. I, I promise. I promise. I won't. I promise. I won't hurt it. Just hang on. Hang on. Let me see. If I'm Imagine if the cat died. Just. <gasps> no. Oh my gosh! If no. If it's damaged. <laughs> okay. Just listen. Is if it's if it's damaged, does it? Will it stand up? Like if I set its bomb on fire, do you think? <laughs> do you think it'll stand up? <laughs> I'm terrified. What if we kill Cass's cat? I'll actually be like heartbroken. <laughs> Oh, no. it stand up? Stand up? It's standing up now. Ah, it's no. sat back down. And I, I can push. Oh, there we go. It worked. Are we get a row or to cast. After some googling, Flick has found a command that could essentially change the owner of the cat over to me to where I could then teleport it to Cass's plot, but we didn't want to risk anything messing up on the live server, so we went over to Pinecraft test server to check it out. Try it, try it, try it. It worked! Did you? Uh, it worked! Wait, what did you do? I'm copying a hook of you. Come on, 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 come on. See, oh, personally, so I sweet. think my idea was perfectly fine. No! <laughs> Top of the nether. We can then get the cat into the nether, build a stairway up to the top of the nether, and then row the cat <laughs> to, to Cass's house, get a port like I'll build a portal at Cass's house, and then we'll go through the <laughs> we'll go through the portal there. How does that sound? Crazy! Oh no. Alright, alright, alright. Uh, so yeah, tra transfer it to, to me. Yep, yeah, it's mine. Okay, okay, okay. I'm then gonna um TP to Cass's plot. Hang on. Okay. Okay. No, not oh. yet. Okay, sorry, sorry, sorry. Oh my god. <laughs> okay, okay. Are you are you ready? Are you ready? Ready? Okay. Three, two, one, now. No. Damn it. Poo. After all this? Wait, wait, wait. Maybe it's because I'm flying. Come on. I'm just I'm just gonna go in in survival. Hopefully I don't get absolutely smacked. Okay, right. Meow. <gasps> the castle here! Wait! Where is it? Oh, it's Flick is it's here. Flick is wait, wait, the, it's the plot. It's at the plot. It's at the plot. It's 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 here. It's here. It's here. <laughs> oh my god, I'm so excited. Hang on. <laughs> come, come, little kitty cat. What the heck? Okay. Um, no, I can't click it. <gasps> I'm so happy. Yeah. I'm so, so happy. Cute. That's right. so sweet. Well done, Flick is. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. bye. <laughs> What the heck people would do that for me? <laughs> oh. Hello everyone and welcome back to Pinecraft Equestrian. I feel like the start of this video was the definition of like, it's the thought that counts. Like, yes, this is a video game. This is Minecraft. It is just a cat. I could have gotten another cat, but Thank you so much to Flickers and Abby who literally went out of their way for so long to find my cat, you know. It took half an hour just to find the village, you know, like that's just, it's, it's just so kind. Thank you guys so much. That's also not the only kindness that I have experienced on this server. One of the first days that I was here, one of you guys actually came to my plot of land and... I didn't notice this at the time, but a little later on, I noticed that you guys left a little gift box and it was really kind. You guys, I was coming around here. I was going to go down to the farm to check on the you know, little baby cow down there. Someone's left me something from a mystery to just another pixel. What the heck? Okay. Oh, a play ahead. I didn't know you could buy those. <gasps> a flower crown! And they've given me a bunch of dye. There's even a saddle. And some bread. Oh my gosh, thank you so much. I'm like always starving on bread. <gasps> I love mushrooms. And there's even a saddle pad. What the heck? I want to see what this play ahead is. Oh, it's like a little grass block. Okay, I thought the texture wasn't loading. loading. Oh my gosh. Thank you so much this is so kind oh my gosh i feel like i have to give something back but i don't know what to give back i'm literally gonna cry i'm literally because star stable doesn't really have the whole gifting thing i've never really had people gift stuff to me and like i'm sorry i'm emotional i'm gonna go look after my sheep and cows now <laughs>
And then once again, today when I was preparing to film the barn tour, which is coming up, one of you guys came and visited my plot and you also gave me some gifts. You guys are so kind. You do not have to do that. You do not have to do that. You do not have to do that. But, um, oh, the other thing we have to do is actually bring- <gasps> Do not shoot my cat! Ow! No. No. Um, we have to bring Moira Cat over to the new barn. She's gonna be a little I barn I still cat think it's there. more like a Milo Cat. I don't know, I can't- They just gave me- They just- They just gave me a gift. Oh my god, that's so cute. Oh my god, look, it's a little- Oh my god, it's- Oh my- Oh no, oh no, oh no. Oh, that's so cute. Oh my gosh, thank you. And there's also a bucket of tropical fish. Oh my gosh, I'm definitely going to put those somewhere. Oh my gosh, gotta go, gotta go, gotta go, gotta go. Gotta go. Gotta go. I'm stuck. I'm, stuck. I'm back. Ah! <laughs> what are you doing? No! <laughs> <laughs> but with all of that out of the way i apologize if this video is kind of long i just want to always try and like put as much content in as possible let's get started with the barn tour with my little brother i'm gonna eat yeah maybe that's a good idea welcome to the unnamed estate currently we're probably gonna come up with a final name on twitch tomorrow times will be on the screen if you're watching this as it comes come out. join Completely. We can also name my chicken. Yes, we have a couple of pets to name you guys. Speaking of pets, the dog in the background is one of your guys' pets, I think. I don't know why. I thought it was my little brother's pet, but apparently it is not. <laughs> so it, is it, ain't it ain't mine. It ain't mine. I accidentally clicked F9, which is my stop record button, instead of <laughs> change my camera perspective, but okay. <laughs> Welcome. As you guys can see, it is very incomplete. If I just fly up really quickly, um, there is a, quite a bit of terraforming. These trees here are kind of hiding it. I'll come back to my little brother. But yeah, there's quite a bit of just not terraformed over there. And also the flooring is not complete. I do have ideas for what I want to finish the pathways to look like, but I have not um, collected the materials or dug it all the way up yet. So I'm also going to be doing that on Twitch if we have time tomorrow. I think we should start outside. This here is the original. Arena. I do want to add a couple of touch ups. I'm not insanely happy with this entrance, but um, yeah, it's just a little arena. This over here is a tree that I can't get rid of. I need to get one of the admins to get rid of it because it's on my borderline and I just, I can't delete it. That's my bad. But here is the barn from the outside. You guys will probably get some fancy shots with replay mod. But um, yeah, it's very overgrown. I wanted it to look different to my swim barn. And I feel like when I don't follow a tutorial, all my buildings look the exact same. But anyways, so here it is. Um, oh, there you are. Now let's start with all the horse side of things. I'll introduce my horse and then my little brother will introduce his horses. So here we have Betsy, the OG. This barn is, I'm starting off with training horses and reselling them slash doing competitions with them when competitions are held. So you might have your chance on buying a just another pixel horse if that is something you're interested in. But yes, Betsy is never going to be for sale. Betsy is my horse. Um, over here we have Wallace and um, yep, that's Wallace. Then we have just another pixel horse, which is one of the the horse that you guys are going to be naming in the Twitch stream tomorrow. So stay tuned for the official name. And the final one of mine in the stable is Sir Heyday over there. We also have two more white horses or grey horses. I think they're grey because they have a muzzle yeah so gray horses is galileo and galilei i bought galilei because it was pretty cheap and i saw Gal the name galileo in the background on another horse and i really wanted to have like galileo galilei i then ended up buying galileo anyways because galileo was actually abigail's horse and i thought it'd be cool to own a horse from the abigail pinehaven but um galileo and galilei there's not enough space in my stable so they're gonna be like paddock horses but yeah that's kind of my horses right now okay what introduce us have my original horse which is billy he as has two you can see eyes. doors are just not a thing apparently <laughs> 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 
Anyway, so I, I'll never sell Billy. And then I also have a Gelato, which is hydrate in the in Italian. Because of Twitch. I have it as a I have it as a jab at the people who named Hannah's horse vodka. It's vodka, not vodka. <laughs> There's a lot of talk vodka. about Twitch in today's video. I do apologize because I know not everyone has Twitch, but yes. Um, we had a vote between Vokva or Idrato for my Swam yeah, those survival were the two final, Those were the two finalists, and I, I lost Idrato. Yeah. I lost every major vote that day. I'm sad. You did, you did. Shall we go back to the start? By the way, this flooring, I started out with wood flooring, and then I realized wood flooring might not be realistic. So I did add, like, stone drainage kind of systems, but I'm not insanely happy with it, but you know what? It looks fine. Also, re like, these are horse-friendly berries. I feel feel like having a bunch of greenery isn't realistic in a barn but like I don't know so when you first enter there is the feeding area we actually have a bunch of hay right now but I do hope to get a, little, a carrot farm going this place is very incomplete we don't have a paddock we don't have like we actually have a farm over there but like it's it's not really complete or anything like there's a lot of stuff that I want to add to this but um yeah we do have a feeding area this is also a composter but it's retextured to look like a feed bin so i just kind of put it here i actually want to put like a trap door above it so you can like open and close it i don't know kind of vibes like that but yeah a little feeding area we then have like our awards shelf so these item frames here are going to hold like um, rosettes or ribbons whatever they're called and I'm hoping to ask an admin to make the item frames invisible if that's something that they could do um, once the rosettes are in them just because I feel like that might look better but I don't know and there's also shelves because I believe that you can also buy like trophy heads from the shop and that might be like a reward for some of the races so we could put some trophies there moving along we have the tack room here the vines are going a little bit crazy but I don't like the look of string to stop them like I know it stops string stops vines growing but I just hate like it's pretty subtle but I still see it and I just don't like it so sometimes I trim it sometimes I don't there's also you know these are meant to be like saddle racks but I can't make it look as good as what they look like at Pinton stables and I couldn't be bothered about that so they're just in item frames we also have horse blankets in a barrel extra saddles I have so many saddles um some blank uh, whatever they're called blankets pads or whatever they're called horse horse pad saddle pads that's horse oh my gosh there's also golden horse armor which is actually halters and stuff in there and all the saddle uh blankets and these are supposed to be kind of like um what are they like a horse a saddle thing that you put i'm really bad at terminology but it's actually just an anvil you know Moving along, we have the wash stall, which is purely for aesthetics. It does have a wheelbarrow that I made, and it's honestly not the best because <laughs> I'm using an item block of chocolate. And then these, um, in the tutorial I followed, they're meant to be like wheel heads, but you can't use commands to get wheel heads on survival. So I bought energy drinks, which wasn't the best um, thing. I actually thought with a skull... skull skulls would look better and i went to the nether and i died so many times and i fought so many with the skeletons and i did not get even one so we're making do and also there's like a little trident here which is meant to be a pitchfork but unfortunately once again i can't get it to look like they have it at pint and staples and um yeah there's also a little tap here and once i find a sponge it will go there but i there's no sponges yet now we're on to okay just outside this is my little brother's like headquarters he is the stable boy he's gonna have a different skin he just hasn't finished it yet but also this is probably gonna be yeah another. i should probably uh work on that nah it's it's fine it's fine this is gonna be another reward display area but my little brother can take you through his house which full disclosure i decorated he did the rug but like i did everything else <laughs> yes thank you so here we have like a chest and furnace and crafting area. Um, here's the rug I made. It's supposed to be my my symbol. Um, my sister bought me this Baby Yoda. I spent so much money doing this. I had a hundred thousand dollars, and I bought so many player heads. I will be right back. All I'm right. getting some welcome home gifts for you. Me build entire place. Me decorates your entire home. Me, I'll get you a welcome home gift. 
<laughs> oh my gosh, it's so expensive. I was gonna buy you multiple gifts, but I think that I can only afford one. I'll get that one too. There we go. Okay. Would you like to see your gifts? Yes. Are you ready? Are you ready? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Here's the first one. Oh. Can you see what it is? Yes. Um, 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 um. You go like that. Look at it. Oh my god. It's yes. a baby Yoda. And now I wasn't sure what else to get you. So maybe we'll put this one in the bedroom. What you did you? Yes. Let's uh, go. I, I the, there's too many characters and I wasn't sure which ones you were your favorites. So. And then up here is like my bedroom basically, where it's got a that galaxy picture and like R two D two and a massive horse. It's <laughs> so cute. It's so cute. Oh my god. Oh my. The chicken. <laughs> <laughs> this is also yeah, a pet yeah, which you guys are going to be naming tomorrow. Currently, it's neighbors. <laughs> oh, we don't. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay, so I typed too fast and so I missed Belpoon. <laughs> Anyways, I also bought this. It's R2D2. Yeah, R2D2. Yeah. And also, like, he I think he likes pace. But unfortunately, like, that's the only non-horse painting, so there's also just a massive horse painting there. I didn't know what else to do. As you guys can tell when I don't know what to do, I just put a plant. Like, there's just, there's just plants. Just yep. plants. And look, he has, I think we missed it, but it's, like, the prettiest sunset. Like, it's actually gorgeous looking outside this window. I'm kind of jealous. You definitely have a better view than I do of the mountains and, like, the waterfall over there. Yes. There's also a, a random chest. I, d I didn't know what to put there, and I did try a plant, but it looked a little bit strange. <laughs> so there's, 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 there's a chest. But I think that's basically it for the unnamed barn. Are we also going to name the barn and Twitch? Or? Probably, yeah. I'll get some feedback on it. Moral of the story, if you haven't already, follow me on Twitch. Oh my gosh, what? the new dog animations are just so cute. Look, it's wagging its little tail. Oh my gosh, it's so cute. Who, who left the dog? I want to know. Luna. Oh, Luna. I don't know. But it's very cute. I'm not saying, like, it's it's very cute. It's kind of fun to just, just have you guys. Next thing, there's just going to be like 5 million <laughs> dogs just left here. <laughs> <laughs> Yep. All right, so the last thing that I wanted to show you guys before the end of the, this video, because I know it's probably very, very long, is obviously my house does not look very different. In fact, it is basically the same thing. Also, by the way, um, Abby was super kind and also gave me some lime concrete because that's my green screen. Oops, over there right now. So a bunch of awesome, very kind stuff as well. Thank you, thank you. It literally, it's so kind. The last thing we have to do is obviously bring the cat over to the barn. The other thing is, the house looks the same. In fact, it looks even more chaotic. But I did build a little chest room down here, which I'm rather proud of. It's still kind of small. We're kind of running out of um, cobblestone and dirt space. But yeah, this is this is the chest room. It's kind of nice. I do like it. But let's go ahead and end off this video by bringing the cat over to the barn to sit down. All right. I'm kind of like scared. Like I'm scared to lose this cat. I'm going to be honest. Okay. Oh, okay. I believe if we TP now, the cat will actually TP with us. They've added a new TP command. Plot TP 10471. Oh no, we're on the roof. <gasps> oh. Please tell me you're going to teleport down here and not jump. Please teleport tp tp down <gasps> oh thank gosh oh my gosh it's getting dark time okay let's come in here you gotta come in here come in here little kitty cat i don't know where to let you sit down maybe you can sit down like up here or something can i like make it so you're maybe if i grab this lead come on little kitty cat come up here oh so close so close Oh my god, the, oh my gosh, the cat animations are so cute. <gasps> the 
That is so adorable. Stop. I can't. Oh my gosh. Well, in this very dark nighttime, I wanted to say thank you guys so much for watching this Pinecraft equestrian video. Welcome to the unnamed barn. I'm very excited to get a name going. I am going to set up a player wall for you guys. Please do not be shy to teleport to me at all if you're ever in the game. If you need some help setting up Pinecraft equestrian, then on the screen right now is going to be my complete beginner's tutorial to how to make money and how everything on the server works that you need to know as a beginner. I've still learned a couple of things since then, like you can, you can actually do slash jobs and become a farmer and that can get you quite a lot of money as well. But yeah, it's the basics, you know? Thank you guys so much for your continuous support and once again, thank you Abby and Flickers and everyone who gave me little gifts. I really appreciate it. You guys are so kind and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!